welcome to the Bouncing Act New York Edition. I'm Montel Williams. We're bringing you community stories and introducing you to businesses and people who are making a difference. So let's see who's making a difference right here in your neighborhood. On this episode of The Balancing Act, we're showing you why you might be wearing the wrong size jeans and what you can do about it. Vacation time, anyone? We have the best secrets on how to have an enchanted experience in the magical world of Disney. We're visiting a healthcare center that promotes health and wellness in a family-friendly environment. Accidents happen every day and it's important to know your rights. We have tips on how to find the perfect rented home. Plus, lots more. We love to keep up with the latest fashion trends. And on the Bouncing Act, let's see what's currently the talk of the town. Did you know that one of the most popular fabrics used in fashion is denim? Jeans are considered one of the most famous and versatile pieces of clothing ever created. But did you know that most women are wearing the wrong size jeans? Here's how to get it right. Fashion industry titans have been dictating sizes and standards for far too long. Other companies will develop a product line that expect a woman to fit directly into their size. But there's a company that's breaking stereotypes by focusing on creating tailored fits for every shape and size. Our goal here at 1822 Denim is to celebrate each woman's size and shape, to make them feel that each product is tailored specifically for them. We saw an absence of good quality and fit in the market. So our goal here was to develop a line of product that was comfortable, affordable, and kind to our planet. The high quality denim designed to be stretchy enough to give you flexibility, an amazing personalized approach, and affordable pricing are some of the features that make this company unique. We're different than our competitors. We design our products to each customer's needs. We spent a lot of time and technology to develop our fabrics to mold to each customer's shape and size. They use a new 3D technology that allows women to get exactly the right fit needed. 3D technology is a very simple and convenient process. The customer snaps two pictures from different angles, submits them through the program, and the program recommends a size and style that is best fit for that customer. This incredible technology will measure and recommend you the best product. We have styles that cover all different size ranges and age groups and body types. We have maternity product, plus size product, Missy product, petites, and junior contemporary. And what we're most known for is our butter denim line of product. Butter denim is our softest, form-fitting, affordable, comfortable product. One of the things I love most about our product is its high level of durability while still providing a level of softness and comfort. 1822 Denim is the perfect example of how you don't need to pay high prices for a well-made product. We use many different social media platforms along with surveys to pay attention to our customers' needs. We analyze data, we pay attention to the feedback, and make changes where necessary. Most of the feedback that we get is extremely positive. Love this jean, best fitting jean I ever purchased. Didn't know what to expect when I first looked at it, and it was the greatest investment that we, I've ever made. Their impact also stretches into the wider community, partnering with foundations like the Food Bank of New York City, Meals on Wheels, No Kid Hungry, Best Friend Animal Society, and finding a way to reduce their imprint on the environment. One of the company's main objectives is also to focus on sustainability. By implementing 3D technology with our product lines, we are able to cut down on the amount of returns, which in turn eliminates waste. Another way we are reducing the carbon footprint is by offering a collection of denim that is called Redenim. This product is made from primarily from recycled denim and plastics. To find out more about how to tailor your jeans to your unique size, visit 1822denim.com and of course visit our website, thebalancingact.com. Our next store is serving up a real treat. Take a look at this. There's a saying that goes, life is magical, don't let anyone tell you otherwise. We go through life creating magical moments that'll stay with us forever. And now it's time to spark your imagination and make your dreams come true. I would describe Walt Disney World as being the most magical place on earth. Uh, this is where families make their dreams come true, whether it be their little daughter dressed in a Cinderella gown or a boy dressed as a pirate running down Main Street in the Magic Kingdom. There's a company that specializes in helping people to have a magical vacation experience. 
Travel Magic's main goal is to make your vacation as stress-free as possible. There are a lot of moving parts with Disney vacations. We want to handle all of that for you so you don't need to worry, you show up, and you have a great time. I thought I knew Disney and I took the advice of a friend and I called Travel Magic and they blew me away with what I didn't know. Travel Magic put together an itinerary for me and they made that trip for my daughter and her sweet 16 an adventure that we'll never ever forget. I have been to Florida a bunch of times to different resorts, but it was so much easier when I had Travel Magic help me because I just called Michelle and said help and I knew she had the expertise and it made it mindless. <laughs> With complimentary service and a boutique style approach, Travel Magic will help you plan every detail. Our complimentary planning service includes the first conversation where we discuss with you the different hotel options, which is going to be the best fit for your family, depending on what you're looking for. From there, we move to a planning call, which is a detailed conversation about your day-to-day -day itinerary. We book all of your dining reservations for you. Uh, we send you final documents so that you are prepared and you show up ready to just have a great vacation. All of that is complimentary to you when you book with us. With this attention to detail and clear know-how, it's no wonder that Travel Magic has been featured in many publications as top travel specialist for Disney vacations. Condé Nast Traveler and WendyParent.com have both recognized Travel Magic as uh, the top travel expert in the Disney destination area. Travel Magic is an authorized Disney vacation planner. We are gold status agency uh, in Disney's earmarked program. We've also been recognized by Sandals and Beaches Resorts as their preferred agency. We are bronze status with Universal Studios. Having a team behind you who will always look for the best price by monitoring promotions and staying up to date with current experiences is invaluable. What I love about dealing with Travel Magic, whenever I called before my trip, whoever answered the phone understood my itinerary, what my last questions were, all the information was right there. It was like dealing with one person. They work as a great team. We handle all Disney destinations, whether it's Disney World in Florida, Disneyland in California, the Disney Resort in Hawaii on Oahu, which is called Aulani, Adventure by Disney, which are high-end group-guided tours all over the world, and Disney Cruise Line. If you think you can do it on your own, let me give you just one piece of advice. Call Travel Magic. They will make your experience so much better than you even think it can be. It's your dream, it's our passion. To find out more about how to start planning your next Disney trip, visit TravelMagic.com and of course, check out our website, TheBalancingAct.com. We all know how important staying healthy is. Check out our next story. The human body is the most extraordinary machine that exists in the world, but when something isn't working correctly, it could be one of the most frightening feelings that exists. Today on The Balancing Act, we'll visit a place that for many years has been providing patients with the best quality care possible. A patient-centered medical home is a model of care where the patient is treated as a whole person. And so we try to engage them in their care and develop a partnership where the patient sees us as their medical home, and that allows us to have a strong, trusting relationship. Batanzas offers a holistic approach with complementary services, so we provide primary care, which includes internal and adult medicine, pediatrics, women's health, behavioral health, and HIV AIDS care. We also provide specialty services, which includes prenatal care, obstetrics and gynecology, podiatry with acupuncture, and dental care. Our services are offered in the most underserved neighborhoods of New York City. Batanzas Health Center was born more than 50 years ago on the Lower East Side, and today they have emerged as a leader in community-based primary care with several centers in New York City. Batanzas was founded over 50 years ago by a pioneer, local activist, and resident of the Lower East Side who worked in the neighborhood hospital and did not like the way patients were being treated. So he acquired a van, and with the assistance of a volunteer physician, went around and provided health services to the street people of New York. Batanzas has three sites. Two of them are located in the Lower East Side of Manhattan, 
and we have one site in the Bushwick Bedford Stuyvesant area of Brooklyn in New York City. With quality, affordable health care in a family friendly environment, Batanzas Health Center is helping people better understand health centers. You could have your dentistry, acupuncture, um, other medical needs, and everything addressed in a community atmosphere uh, in one place. It is one of the better things that happened in the community. Batances was one of the first healthcare centers in New York with a staff of well-rounded clinicians that focus on the whole patient. People that come into the clinic see themselves, they feel welcomed. And because we treat them with respect, they feel that it's a home and they keep coming back. Once Batances came in, uh, things improved greatly. They've created a full treatment program combining all the experts and services for the best result. I am the nurse midwife here working at Batansis. Um, I do full GYN panel as well as all the prenatal patients, um, lactation consulting, and some primary care as well. Many of their amazing medical team has been part of this nonprofit organization for decades. And with a rate of more than 30,000 visits per year, Batances has become part of the community. The practitioners are really excellent, committed to the people that they serve, and um, dedication to each visit. A perfect combination of state-of-the-art technology, a holistic approach, and nutrition care that can deliver quality care in your preferred language. We also include things like meditation, and yoga to help patients use tools that they can take with them wherever they go. We strive to make the community healthier because it makes each individual member healthier. Our community, our people, and as we would like to say, yours for better health. To find out more about how to meet their caring staff and see all the medical services they offer, please visit batances.org and of course you can visit our website, thebalancingact.com. When legal aid is required, what you need most is someone you can trust, as we find out in this next story. Life is full of unplanned events, and unfortunately, as much as we try to control our environment, there's always a chance of having an unforeseen accident that may cause you harm, damage, or loss. Today on The Balancing Act, we're going to show you how to get the right legal help. The most common accidents are typically motor vehicle accidents. Whether it's a car on car, like a hit in the rear, or an intersection case, a question of lights, or a pedestrian hit, pedestrian knockdown. Pedestrians are slip and fall, trip and fall. In the professional arena, every profession has a certain standard that they have to adhere to. And if they depart from that standard, they've committed a malpractice. Whether it's a medical malpractice, engineering, architect, there's a whole array of professions and the results and the damages could be catastrophic. Now that we know what the most common accidents are, what is the first thing we need to do after an accident? If you've been involved in a motor vehicle accident, you, there are certain things that you should and should not do. You should not leave the scene until law enforcement arrives. But once you've regained your composure, you don't want to make any admissions Gather the information from the other motorist, the license plate, the license, driver's license, insurance. Take photos if you can, photos of the vehicles, photos of the scenes, even a panoramic in case there are storefront videos that may have captured it. That's all relevant later on. When the police arrive, you tell them your version of how the accident occurred. And if you need medical attention, then you go ahead and you seek medical attention. When you've been injured in an accident, very often, the, the real effect of those injuries won't manifest for several weeks later. So when you go to the doctor, it's very important that you give them an accurate history with what your present complaints are. That better positions the doctor to evaluate and render a treatment plan for you. Unfortunately, people often make mistakes when choosing a personal injury attorney. People think the bigger the law firm, the better the law firm. When in fact, in my view, that's often just the opposite. The smaller boutique firms usually are much more precise, much more focused on their approach. And the larger firms don't care as much, you just become inventory. With a boutique style litigation firm, Doobie Law helps us understand the importance of feeling protected and understood by your lawyer. I always empower my client that they're the boss, I work for them. Meaning I can't and I won't settle the case without them, without their consent. I want them on board. I will get them the most money the law allows. That's my mantra and I partner with the client. There's a big misconception that small firms cannot fight large defense firms. 
In my experience, I have litigated cases and I have tried cases against the top law firms. I could be going against 10 attorneys. It's still not a fair fight because they don't put in the effort that I put in. So it doesn't matter who they have. The law is the law and if I can prove my case, I'm going to prove it, I'm going to sell it, and I'm going to win my cases. I don't care who I'm against. What I found in over 30 years of practice is clients need to be heard and understood. I give them an assurance with usually one sentence. I look at them and I say, I got you, because I do. To find out more about how Doobie Law can obtain a successful resolution of your case, visit DoobieLaw.com. And of course, you can visit our website, TheBalancingAct.com. Thinking of moving? Well, stay where you are right now and watch this. New York is complex and fascinating at the same time. It's a city where anything is possible. There's an energy that you can feel in the air, an incredible variety of food, history, and art everywhere. And today on The Balancing Act, we'll give you the best tips on how to find your perfect rented home directly from some of the people who have helped build this town. New York City is my life. It's my pulse, it's my breath. It keeps me alive. I love being here. I love walking down the street, seeing people, seeing restaurants open, functioning. There's education, there's arts, there's science. Everything is right here and there's amazing food. If you're ready to rent, there's a family owned and operated business with more than 30 years helping New Yorkers to find the apartment they'll love in the neighborhood they prefer. Being a family business gives us the advantage of knowing our tenants, knowing our employees, and knowing our properties. We're updating them all the time. We're, we're there every single day, so we don't miss a beat, and we know what we need to do to deliver. I pride our company on longevity. Our staff is like our family. They've been with us for a long time, and that is key when it comes to finding a home. What makes us unique is that we're owner developers. So we built these properties from the ground up, foundation, bricks, mortar, you name it. We know these buildings inside and out better than any developer could ever know them. Whether you're looking for an upscale area like Upper East Side or the adventurous feeling of the East Village, Bettina has the choices for the lifestyle you desire. Our lives are always changing. People are working from home or they're choosing to go to an office. We can find the right location for you. We have outdoor spaces, we have properties that are near museums, near schools. So whatever your desire is and whatever you need to do or where you need to be, we can help you find that perfect spot. Let's take a look at some high-end rental properties that could be your next home without having to break the bank. We have a number of different apartment layouts. We have studio alcoves, we have one bedroom, we have two bedrooms, we have convertible studios, we have fitness facilities on premises, we have rooftop terraces, you name it, we can find it. We are a no fee operating business, which means that you can come and look at an apartment and there's no obligation to pay a fee because we own and manage our properties. Having everything under one roof has allowed Bettina to make sure each renter is treated as a tenant and not just another unit number. We care about our residents. We're here to cater to them, to whatever their needs are. We're constantly upgrading our properties, modernizing them, catering to the trends that are going on in today's city. Great management isn't the only thing a renter should look for. Essential amenities should be a top priority as well. We have state-of-the-art security systems, well-lit lobbies, laundry facilities, elevator buildings, and superintendents on premises. Here at Bettina, uh, as a superintendent, I like to jump on, on the issue that we have with the apartments. But most of all, if I can't take care of it, we have a, a great maintenance staff, and that's always kept up to grade. So whatever I can do, we make sure that it happens the next day. And I'll say one last thing. Your Bettina apartment will feel like home from the moment you move in. To find out more about how to find your next perfect rented home, visit BettinaEquities.com and of course you can check out our website, TheBalancingAct.com. If you love art, you're really going to enjoy this story. Meet Carol Furman, a sculptor whose Manhattan studio is setting new trends in a classic favorite, hyper-realistic sculptor. 
Never heard of that before? <laughs> well, you have now. Take a look at this. Hyperrealism is a movement that I started in the late 70s with John DeAndrea and Wayne Hansen. I'm the only woman in the world that does hyperrealistic sculptures. During the last four decades, Carol has become the most renowned, influential, and popular hyperrealist sculptor. When I went to college, I had to work my way through, so I did illustration, and I got paid for doing 22 album covers, The Rolling Stones, uh, I did Monkey Man, I did Alice Cooper Snake for their world tour book. But when I graduated, I knew I always wanted to be a sculptor and I wanted to be a hyper-realist sculptor because I love realism. Great technique, resilience, and originality are distinguishing characteristics that define master artists. Carol Furman's sculptors of women are a great example of this. I began making sculptures of women in the late 70s, but I really didn't know how to do it. So I found an artist who said he'd teach me how to work with the resins. And after experimenting and learning how to cast from life, I finally was able to start my first swimmer called Catalina, uh, the swimmer of the girl breaking through. I love to do sculptures of women because women breaking through is important and women artists breaking through is important. But at a certain point, I thought, well, men have to break through too. And I did the diver and then I did the double diver, which is 36 feet spirally way into the air. Unlike other hyper-realist sculptors, she doesn't put real clothes on her pieces. All of the bathing suits, swim caps, and accessories are sculpted onto the figure as one piece. I love making sculptures. I love to get my hands dirty. I love to cast people. Um, I like to do it all. Because it takes at least a year to two years to finish a piece, I work on many at the same time. Every brilliant and prolific creative professional has invested many hours mastering their skill. There are no shortcuts to mastery. So I had to learn how to really make these pieces um, unforgiving so that they could be outside because I'm the only one that does that. And it took me uh, at least 10 years till I mastered my skill. The entire sculpture is sculpted out of either epoxy or uh, bronze and they're painted with lacquers to look real. And the lacquer enables the pieces to be used outdoors. I do gold leaf, I put crystals on, and a lot of the pieces I put little hairs on. But the outdoor pieces, um, I don't put hair on. And I'm known for the water drops, but only water drops on indoor pieces. Carol has pioneered new approaches to sculpture. Her work has been showcased in exhibitions around the world, placed in selected public spaces, published in several art books and has been purchased by art collectors and philanthropists. My work is owned by 19 museums. I won an award for the World Trade Center. I was one of the 10 finalists. I won the Venice Biennale. I won the Beijing Biennale and the Austrian Biennale. There are five coffee table books written about my career and uh, they started in 1999 to the current one called 50 Years and Looking Good that's just been published. And I'm doing another book, but this is about my autobiography and my life, uh, the life and legacy of Carol Furman. Throughout her artistic career, her style has undergone many transformations, but her passion for art and her love of creating endure. For me, art is everything. I'm art. Without art, I wouldn't be me. Art heals, art makes us happy, art communicates. When I do art, I feel good. To find out more about Carol Furman art, visit carolforman.com and of course visit our website, thebalancingact.com. Whether you're a child or an adult, it's never too late to learn something new. Check this out. Welcome to Sacred Heart University's Discovery Science Center and Planetarium, where the learning is in the doing. Their goal is to inspire wonder and ignite creativity in people of all ages. The Science Center has been a hallmark of the Bridgeport community uh, for upwards of the last 60 years. And uh, with uh, its partnership with Sacred Heart University, uh, we are in the process of reimagining, reinventing, and continuing the wonderful legacy that this, the Science Center has made for generations of families uh, over the last 60 plus years. 
The benefits of the relationship with Discovery Center to the community are, are vast. We're going to be invigorating and expanding uh, programming in ways that will invite K-12 students to come into the museum, uh, as well as their families in new and exciting ways. There really is something for everyone here. Let's take a tour and see for ourselves. Hello and welcome to Sacred Heart University's Discovery Science Center and Planetarium. My name is Erica Eng and I am the Science Center's first executive director. One of our most popular exhibits is our newly renovated Henry B. DuPont III Planetarium. Come on, let's check it out. We feature the latest in Digistar technology. We can seat about 80 people in here. We are ADA accessible, and we have special events in here as well. You can get married under the stars. You can give a presentation for your astronomy course. And this is another way where we're gonna partner with Sacred Heart University. The footage we can render in here in real time comes from live satellite footage such as Hubble, ESO, the European Space Station. In a completely unique experience, we can now fly you through through the solar system in real time, rendering images on the fly. And here's another one of our favorite exhibits. This is Mission Control. Mission Control is one half of our Challenger Learning Center. This is an immersive experience wherein each student has an integral part to play in the successful launching of a spacecraft. Mission Control, this is uh, Mars Space Phobos. Mission Control, this is Mars Space Phobos. So this is actually the spacecraft half. I'm actually in the spacecraft of the Challenger Center for Space Science Education's uh, Learning Center on a Mars simulation. Students would come into the spacecraft and you could see us from your mission control. We not only hit on the almost every single point of STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math, we also touch on the softer skills like communication and teamwork, which as we all know are an invaluable part of education today. And here we are in my favorite gallery, Science on a Sphere. This is a five foot sphere that has a 360 degree projection with four laser projectors mounted in the four corners of this space. We can stream real footage from NOAA, from NASA, and satellite in space. The projections you see are actual footage. This is also one of our favorite galleries to host small events in, receptions, and cocktail hours. And that concludes our tour of Sacred Heart University's Discovery Science Center and Planetarium. I want to thank you so much for joining me, and we hope to see you here real, real soon. For more information, visit shudiscovery.org or go to our website, thebalancingact.com. Thanks so much for joining us on this local edition of The Bouncing Act. We'll see you next time.